Everyone all right? Hopefully yeah, Larry's still alive. Yeah, we had some alive. close calls, but Glenn is fine and... Well, yeah. We're okay. I've got a few cans of gas for your pickup in the trunk of my car. Good to hear it. And things back here? Quiet. Our friend is still in and out over there. He won't survive any more stress. The next order of business is getting those pills out of the pharmacy. Does anyone know where the keys are? Forget it. I'm just... I'm gonna axe the door down. Again. Yeah, was where the shot keys it is, I guess. Uh, ah, Try to get some rest, hon. How can I with those things out there? Keys, keys, keys. It's not much, but here, for the boy. Oh, thanks, Lee. He appreciates it. That's sweet, Lee. It's all melted now. Where'd you hide the keys, Pop? No, I'm sorry to hear your loved one was eaten by the living dead guards. seen anything? Nothing, luckily. Wanna step outside, have a look around? <laughs> I'm not suicidal yet. No, the gate out there is closed. We can hang out in front of the store and be fine. Oh, huh. The keys are probably outside. Sure. Let's go have a look around. Cool. And we'll keep it down. Don't need to bring them back this way with any unnecessary noises. Agreed. I can tell him it's all the care of And if one gets you, they eat you. And whatever's left comes back as one of them. How the fuck? I think it might be more than a couple days before all this gets sorted out. Yeah, I think so too. We better keep it down out of here.
now. Let's head back inside. Okay. I can probably turn on the TV store. But I don't think keys are out there. Carly. Hey, Carly. You seen the keys? I better get back to it. Yep. Thanks, by the way. Don't mention it. Just remember what I said. Yeah, I will. Central High Tech State. Papers a week old. Feels like years. It's not much, but here you go. Thank you. Of course. How's it doing? I'm not sure I got your name. It's Lee. Lily. My dad's Larry. I was just doing what I had to earlier. Everyone was. Now his heart's acting up again and I'm powerless to do anything. And that violence before with my dad, that didn't help. You're from here? I work at Warner Robins. The Air Force Base. Yeah, I know it. Pilot? Nah, just mechanical admin stuff. I deal with a bunch of shitheads and bureaucrats all day. Sometimes a plane, if I'm lucky. You? I work up at UTA. I'm gonna get back to him. Sounds good. Where are the keys? think they'd be behind the register. I don't remember them very well. Walker out there. How we doing? Good. Wanna go have a look around outside? Let's have a look around. Okay. Look at the one trapped over there. Better hear <laughs> that. Oh shit. What? Do you know that guy? Kind of, he has a familiar face. Ah, you're from around here, huh? Could be anybody, you know. They start rotting and get all chewed up and... Shut up, dog. Look at the uniform, though. He could have worked at the drugstore and died with keys in his pocket. It would take a lot of effort to make it safe enough to go out there and see if he has the keys. If we could somehow prove that he worked here, I think it'd be worth it. I'll see what I can find. That guy over there has the keys. How can you be sure? I found this in the office. That boy in the photo worked here. The keys being on him is as good a bet as we can make. Yeah, I agree. We just need to figure out how to get out there and get them. You wouldn't need long, right? Nah, just a few seconds. Maybe there's a way to distract them and buy you some time. Think you can do anything with this? You know what I could do? What's that? Universal. I could program it to work with those TVs across the street. Let's just hope the power's still on. You can just do that? 
I memorized all the codes when I was in AV. Let's try. Well fucking done, Doug. All that dork nonsense might save a life. Who's to say it already hasn't? I got a few of them to take notice. guys showed up and they tried. And what happened? I think they're most of who you see wandering around out there. I can't reach that brick. Bullshit. Man, that's a hasty fortification job over there. Yeah, it didn't work. be able to clear the street. Louder. Break the window on it. How get brick? Doug reach for a brick. I just need to get the brick. It's a combination lock. Doug, you want to get this door open? About that. You've got the combo, right? No. Did anyone ever have it? Look, man, there were a lot of those things trying to get in. Huh. And now we can't get back out onto the street. We're also party to some egregious fire code violations. Well. That's a plot twist. I'd have to cut it off with the axe. Radio. Let's head back inside. Okay. What are you messing around with there? A radio. I can't get it to work, though. Here, let me have a look. Derp. Hmm, nothing. There are no batteries in this thing. What now? Do you know that there are no batteries in that thing? Yeah, of course. I mean, yeah. No. I can try to find some. Needs two. Thanks. I wouldn't even really know what to look for. Really? Battery from the remote. Here. I've been finding some stuff to eat. Oh, uh, thanks. You're welcome. Are you sure your girl doesn't need it? She's good. I've been trying to keep her fed and watered. You're a good caretaker. Thanks. I found this remote in the office, but I'm pretty sure the batteries won't fit. It needs the big stumpy ones. Yeah, these are no good. Okay. The big stumpy ones. find another. This battery should fit the radio. Great, thanks. I'm still looking for batteries for that day. Thanks, I appreciate it. Another battery.
And here's another one. Should be able to get it to work now. It's still not working? Yeah, I can't figure it out. Let me have a look at that thing. Go ahead. Did put them in backwards. Oh my god, Carly. As the underworld it. continues to spread unchecked, the estimated death toll continues to skyrocket. WABE urges you to stay indoors and avoid any contact with individuals you suspect may have been exposed. The station is okay. In the event of a full... Uh, uh, my, my producer's telling me we have to get off the air. Steve. Uh, WABE wishes you and your loved ones. God bless you all. Hey there. Radio sign off didn't sound too good. Are you okay? I'm fine. You don't have to be. It's traumatic. I'm sure some people got out. Maybe they're all being rescued. Then again, maybe not. How are we doing? Good. Want to go have a look around outside? Not now. All right. Can you do something with the radio, Doug? Can I take the radio? Story of the century here, huh? Yeah, and I've got shit for recording equipment. And from the looks of it, there isn't going to be any shortage of first-hand accounts. You do radio? That's right. Well, until some piece of shit politicians yank our funding, and I hit the blogosphere. You seem to handle yourself pretty well. <laughs> really? I'm a disaster. I can't tell. My news editor was eaten about five feet away from me, and I would have joined her if it wasn't for that dorky guy on watch over there. I'm sorry. She was an asshole, but, you know. Yeah. That guy saved you? Yeah. Can you believe it? Those creeps, or, or ghouls, or whatever the hell they are. They were pulling our van apart, and that guy, Doug, just came to the rescue. You can never tell who the heroic ones are gonna be, I suppose. He's kinda cute. In that parent's basement sort of way. Huh? Huh? Oh, nothing. How'd you end up here? We drove up to cover the Cherry Blossom Festival. Real hard-hitting stuff. Sounds worth it. I better get back to it. Yep. Thanks, by the way. Don't mention it. Just remember what I said. Yeah, I will. Hey, Doug. Got good news for you, bro. How we doing? Good. Want to go have a look around outside? How am I going to get the TVs to be louder? Let's have a look around. Okay. <laughs> 